Hello, my loves, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha, and I am the Boho Witch here on YouTube and Artsy Mouse over on Instagram. If you aren't already following me on Instagram, I want to invite you to do so now because I will be doing a giveaway over there very soon. Welcome back to all my subscribers. I do want to give you guys a big thank you and a virtual hug for all your support that you've been giving me lately. I just recently hit a thousand followers on my Instagram and my YouTube channel here has been growing. So thank you, thank you again, everyone. Alrighty, now let's get into it. So in today's video, we are going to be unboxing a box from Tamed Wild. Now this is their uh, March box and it's all about Ostara. So here's their little info cards that they give you with an Ostara ritual, and I will be sharing that at the end of the video, so stick around for that. Now this ritual was for Ostara, and Ostara has already passed, but you can perform this ritual at any time, so it is timeless. Alright, the first thing we got out of our box is an Ostara tea. It has chamomile and peppermint in it, two of my favorite herbs for teas, so that's awesome. Alright, so the next thing we got out of our box is a piece of jewelry from their sister company, North of Stella. It features what looks like to me to be black onyx and then a cute little moon charm on it as well. You can wear the necklace to connect with the energies of the moon, even during seasons like we're in right now, dedicated to the sun. All right, and now we have another stone or crystal. So this is an agate egg. Now, I don't know what type of agate it is. I'll have to look that up later. But eggs are a symbol of rebirth, new beginnings, regeneration, and the fertile essence of spring, the time that we're in right now. So this egg is supposed to represent you in this ritual. I just can't get over how the top of that egg looks. <laughs> it's funny. Beautiful, but kind of funny. All right, next thing we got out of our box is a Rose of Jericho. So it is also called the resurrection plant because although it looks very dead and shriveled up, if you put it in a shallow bowl of water, it actually opens up and blooms to about five times its current size. So it's really good for manifestation and transformation spells. All right, and the last thing that we have in our box is this beautiful Egyptian perfume bottle. So they want you to use this to store the rest of your solar charged water from the Ostar ritual. All right, so that was the last thing in our box. So now I'm going to bring out the ritual. So you guys can go ahead and pause this, screenshot it, do whatever you want, get that information so you guys can do this ritual at home. Now, if you don't have these specific items, don't worry. Witchcraft is all about using what you have at home on hand. So go ahead and substitute whatever feels right to you for this ritual so you guys can perform it at home as well. If you have any questions or comments how you can do that, uh, ask me below and I will definitely, definitely get back to you. All right, well, I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. If you aren't subscribed, I want to invite you to do so now and give me a big thumbs up if you can. And as always, be kind to each other, do what you will, but harm none. All right, bye guys.